guys, stick to the end of the video. I have a free giveaway for you for Easter. We're gonna use the Elmer's Craft Blonde Glue. We're gonna use some moss. I picked this up $3.99 at Walmart. I didn't go with the cheaper stuff from Dollar Tree, but you could. I just, I don't know. I already had this, so I decided to use this. And basically what I'm gonna do is spray around the edges here. I'm not gonna bother covering this. The moss is expensive. I don't have a lot of it. I'll leave this blank because the plate's gonna go over there anyway and just spray this edge and then put the moss on the plate. Which, it's kind of windy out here right now, so the spray and the moss could run amok on me. I'm gonna spray this outside of the camera view. And I'm only gonna do half. I just sprayed half of it and then I'm gonna put this stuff on it and hope it sticks. pots. You've seen me use them before, but I've got these cute little rosebuds that I picked up at Michael's. They were $5.99, 40% off. And I'm going to use a couple of these and make a little pot here. I think that's going to look super cute. And I have six of these. These were actually sitting in my dough bowl, but now I'm going to repurpose them for the Easter plates and I picked this up at the Dollar Tree just gonna cut this in squares them in half first and see how that does stick them in there dang all right look what I did I just went to the Dollar Tree and they didn't have any more of these at my Dollar Tree, so I don't want to break anymore. So maybe, don't force it. Let's use it a little smaller. Now I've got these little guys. They are super cute. I need to get a wire clippers. Okay, can't find my wire cutters, so I'm just gonna use the scissors and think. I think that'll work. It's pretty. You might ruin your scissors, or maybe your scissors won't work. There. Okay. Stick that in there. Cute. So if you want to make it a little darker, you can use this antiquing stuff. Don't know that I'm going to do that. So I have my moss from the Dollar Tree. Spanish moss, take a little bit of that out. I'm getting really into these little antique pots and antique flowers this year. I guess you guys have noticed that. But it's nice because it's rustic and it's it's just cute. That's cute. That will look absolutely adorable on the plate.
So while I was at Michael's today, I found these two houseplant cloche with metal base. So that started at $17.99. The other one was $22.99, but I got 40% off. And so they were like seven and nine dollars. And um, it stuck. And I just love these, I'll tell you. My cousins in the Netherlands had these in the window of their home. And I thought they were so beautiful. She had all kinds of beautiful stuff displayed in there, like only the Dutch beauties can. And ever since I saw them, I thought that I would like some of them. I picked these up, they fit perfectly at the Dollar Tree. And now we have to decide what exactly we're gonna do here. I have three pink tulips that I just antiqued. So looking at the tulips, I think they're gonna go in the big cloche. And of course, tulips are Dutch. So of course, my Dutch great-grandma needs to go in there. Looks like Beauty and the Beast. For the wreath, I'm just cutting off these flowers from their bushy things. bushy things, and I'm gonna spread them evenly around the wreath. All right, so I've gotten all these nests, and this is gonna go in my wreath, and then I also have some greens. I am not a floral designer. I am not, or never have been, a gardener or a wreath designer. But it would make perfect sense to me that you want to evenly put things around the wreath. take all this out at the end of the summer and put something fall and autumn in uh, this is perfect the wires and the twigs are holding it all in place and it's so beautiful
You ready for this? This is your freebie. These bunnies. As a download, not as the canvases, but as a download, these darling little Easter bunnies. I've got two of them and they're so cute. They would be adorable for any kind of craft item. You can use them for decoupage. You can use them on jars, on candles. Uh, you can make pillows out of them. You can, of course, make canvases out of them. I have decorated with these in my kitchen. These bunnies are gonna be up all summer long, and I just think they're so cute. They're from Victorian Ephemera, and I love them. So they're free. All you have to do is go to my website, www.annclaytheprimitivehome.com for this weekend only. That's Easter weekend 2021. At midnight, they will expire and they will go back to $8. But these are a thank you present for you guys being absolutely just such wonderful, wonderful people and just being a part of the community. I appreciate it so very, very much. Love you guys and happy Easter.